Hi everyone, welcome to the Contributors channel where you can learn how to start and grow your business and how to make money. Today I'd like to share with you the only way to dominate your industry. If you watch this video until the end, you will learn what is X Factor and why do you need to define and refine it? What X Factors helped Apple, Amazon and Rockefeller to dominate their industries? And finally, what five questions can help you to define X factor for your business to dominate in your industry? Guys, I record this video to contribute mine and guests' knowledge and experience to help you start and grow your business. Please help me show this video to more people. All you need to do is to like and leave a comment below. Thank you. My name is Viktor Gichan and the Contributors channel just reached 100,000 views. Thank you so much for your support. The essence of any business is the customer experience. What customers get from you and what they get from your competitor. This is the only one thing which differentiates your business. The better you are at shaping that experience, the greater your reach and the better your profits. If you really want to take your business to the next level and change it to exponential, you need to offer something your competitor doesn't. What is X Factor in business? This is the ability to add tangible or intangible value to your product or service, do more for your clients than your competitor and consistently maintain that standard. For example, Apple has been the dominant by consistently merging art and technology into new products. The X factor is constant innovation. Amazon has become the number one player in online retail because of their expedited shipping through Prime. So the X factor is their Prime membership. At its core, an X factor is the way of thinking about who you are, what business you are in, and what you can bring to the marketplace. An X factor doesn't always have to be an industry disruptor. It can be your culture, your vision, your mission, or something else meaningful. Let's look closely what three X factors helped David D. Rockefeller to dominate the oil industry and build a trillion dollar business. In the beginning, he was just a co-owner of an oil refinery and barely made ends meet like hundreds of others. But everything changed after Rockefeller met a railroad tycoon Cornelius Vanderbilt who was looking for an oil refinery that would be able to provide a steady usage of his railroads for transporting tank carts with crude oil. Rockefeller understood that Wonderbuilt barely needed his help and negotiated 30% discount on the cost of transportation. That deal gave Standard Oil the first X factor. By using 30% discount, Rockefeller was able to sell oil 30% cheaper than competitors. As a result, within one year, Standard Oil had become number one oil refinery in Midwest. As I mentioned in the beginning, guys, to dominate your industry, you need to do more for your clients than any of your competitors and consistently maintain that standard. Let's see what David D. Rockefeller did to maintain his domination. Those days, for transporting oil, companies used metal barrels. Standard Oil created their own barrels made of wood, which were 30% lighter, and this allowed Standard Oil to get additional 30% price reduction. Now they could deliver 30% more oil for the same price. This second X factor, which made Standard Oil number one in oil industry in entire US. At some point, the railroads breached the contract and stopped providing 30% discount to Standard Oil. To address this issue, which could end Standard Oil domination, David D. Rockefeller built a world's first oil pipelines from its refineries to the closest ports. By building oil pipelines, Standard Oil put out of business a bunch of railroads and were able to reduce the cost of oil transportation drastically. And this third 
X Factor had made Standard Oil the number one oil company in the entire world. Creating an X Factor requires a combination of skills, psychology and experience to find your competitive edge. I want to give you something practical so you can use it to find your X Factor. But before, I would like you to like this video, please share and subscribe to be notified about my new videos. Thank you so much. Here are five questions you should ask yourself about your business to define X factor to dominate in your industry. Question number one, what makes your company stand out? Number two, how do you offer your customers the most value? Question number three, what is your company great at? Question number four, what makes you stand out individually? Question number five, what could your X factor become? Define how you can continually add value to your clients and what way you can stay ahead of the competition. This is the opportunity for your business to stand out, innovate and develop new solutions, create raving fan customers and annihilate their competition. I hope this video was helpful and if you have any questions, leave a comment below. If you like this video, please like and share, subscribe and hit the bell below to be notified about my new videos. Thanks for watching and supporting the channel. Stay healthy, stay wealthy, stay tuned.